Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and for today's video, this will be a tutorial plus review in one because I will be trying the BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival Palette. So this is a limited edition and it is a very affordable brand from the US and it has all these beautiful shades inside. So if you want to see if it's good and how I've achieved this look right here, then keep on watching. Hey guys, so this is the BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival Palette. I think this is a limited edition. If you don't know BH Cosmetics, it is a very affordable makeup brand based in the US. So this retails for $18 at their website. I think it's sold out now. And I bought this at a seller from Shopee at 1,100 pesos. So she only has a few stocks, so I don't know if it's still available. And this is what the palette looks like. It's really, really nice. It comes in a sliding box with the same design. And I think it's really, really beautiful. It's fun. It's very colorful. And this is what it looks like inside. It has this plastic protector. And these are the colors. They are very colorful and very fun. For a person who loves colored eyeshadows, this is a dream. And only for $18. I think it's worth your money. But we'll still try it if it's any good. It's also my first time trying the brand. Lagi rin ako nakakita ng mga... BH Cosmetics na palette sa Shopee and also sa mga Instagram, Facebook group. Pero itong palette talaga na to yung nakapagpakuha ng attention ko. Kasi diba guys, oh, super colorful and talagang ang ganda niya guys. Mahilig kasi talaga ako sa mga colored eyeshadows. So I'll swatch them today for you. Okay guys, so this is the first two rows swatched. And they are very pigmented. They are very nice. I really love these mattes here and also the shimmers are really nice these colors are really pretty guys i swear and these are the last two rows guys all colors are so vibrant and this shade right here is really really nice it has pieces of glitter in it uh, i just really love the colors and there i already set my eyes with concealer and i did not set it with powder because i want more intense colors with this palette and i'm thinking i want a cotton candy look so i will be playing with these colors these teals and pinks and purples so i'm gonna start with this light blue color using a blending brush and it already picked up a lot of pigment so i'm just gonna tap it like says and work it on my inner crease. It's also nice that this palette has a mirror, so I really love that. Wow, it's really pigmented. That's a really nice color. And now I'm gonna be dipping into Electric, this light pink shade right here with a clean blending brush and I'm just gonna pack it inside and then blending it outwards. Those two colors blended really nicely and it created a small lilac color like Oh, that's so nice. Next, take another clean blending brush and I will be dipping in this matte purple shade called Swag and apply it here on my outer V. And I want just a tiny bit of purple Ooh, I love that I love that so much and I'm just gonna blend these all together and 
And then I'm just gonna add some concealer here at the center of my eyes. But I won't cut my crease. I just want the shimmer to pop up. So I'm just gonna add this and then blend it a bit. And now I'm gonna add the shade. Oh, this is hard. There are so many nice shimmers in here. I think I will just use this shimmer blue shade called Ultimate. And I'll just use my fingers to pack it in. Ooh, girl, that is really pretty. And I'm just gonna blend it with the other colors. So my ring light died. And this is what it looks like right now. I blended it just to make it look like it's an entire look. And I'm not finished yet. I'll be using this green shimmer under my eyes to give it some, some contrast and yeah. And I'm just gonna add some purple on the end. And that's the eye makeup, I think. I'm just gonna be blending it more and also I'll be adding eyelashes and eyeliners and I'll be right back. A few moments later. Okay guys, so this is the finished look right now and I really love it so much. Also, I forgot to tell that I put this shimmer right here called Trixie on the inner corners of my eyes and also on my brow bone. And I can tell you guys, this eyeshadow palette is so pigmented. I really love the colors, guys. It really pops up and I can see it on my camera viewfinder. It's really, really nice and really pretty. I love this palette so much. All shades are really nice. They are all pigmented, really easy to blend. Well, I haven't tried the other colors yet on my eyes, but based on the swatches that I felt, I think they will blend really well. And also, the price point is such a steal. I really love it. It's so affordable and also they are really high quality pigments and the shades, guys. Oh, this palette is just really gorgeous itself. You can also achieve a sunset look with this. That will be so beautiful. The only downside about this palette is that it doesn't have a really light neutral shade for transition. But we all have neutral palettes out there. So the only thing is that you need to get another palette for transition shade. But that's okay. I still love this palette. I really love it so much. I think this is my new favorite. I guess but I have a lot of favorites so it's really nice and I love this eye look so much. I would totally recommend this palette for everyone who wants very colorful palettes. This palette has every color you need. If you have like a small budget, this is a perfect colorful palette for you. And it also has neutral shades so you can achieve some neutral looks with this. It's really an all-in-one palette except there's no transition shade but for the price, this is really worth your money. So guys, that was it. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe down below for more videos like this. I hope I see you on the next video.